Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fireside and Terror. Hope everybody's well. So, funny story with the cusp baby reading. So I paused to clear the decks, and as long as I'm paused, you know it. Got up, took a potty break, made some coffee, came back, thought I hit the record button. I didn't hit the record button. So I sat there jabbering at the camera for the last three readings of that and was talking to no one, and by the time I got done, I had to leave. So it's like, well, this is a problem. I guess I will just finish this up tomorrow. So this is where we're at. This is what we're doing. Capricorn, Aquarius, you're up. Sometimes it's just the universe's way of saying that the messages weren't right, right? Okay. Quick shuffle. Hmm. Name swords popped out. Hmm. Could be some communication coming in. <sighs> King of Pentacles upright, King of Swords reversed. Ooh. Where's the problem? You're doing well. In fact, you're doing amazing. The challenge is possibly a little bit of an attitude problem. Maybe lack of communication. I'll throw a clarifier on it in a second. Hmm. Oh, I suppose I should tip that down, huh? So you don't have to look at my ugly mug anymore. All right. We three kings, holy cow. Coming out of a state of heartbreak, coming out of a state of anxiety, exploring your options, forward movement, possibly getting up the gumption, either give or receive a cup. It all happened. Okay, you got your heart broke. You moved on from something. There was a negative energy. Things weren't flowing. You were in a state of sadness. You're doing good now. Possibly a little bit of a bad attitude. Bottom of the deck. Two of Pentacles. You're regaining your balance. Right on. Okay, a little bit of clarity. A little bit of clarity. Capricorn Aquarius Cusp Babies. A little bit of clarity, please. Talk to me about this King of Swords reversed. Oh, wow. Double reversed, tower reversed. Okay. So, releasing yourself from something toxic. Possibly getting ready to rebuild. Why the bad attitude? Why the anger? Why the emotion? There is a lot of emotion here. Knight of Coins to the Queen of Coins slowly. The pace at which you come out of this. Okay. Okay. You could be wanting to make someone an offer. You could be getting ready to receive an offer. You're getting you back, Cap, Aquarius. You're getting you back. Huh. All right. That's, that's awesome. I like it. I like it a lot. Merry Christmas. Or happy non-denominational winter holiday. Whatever you celebrate. All right. Three swords reversed, one card. Six of Wands into the Seven of Wands. You're coming out of that straight heartbreak. You're declaring victory. You're defeating your inner demons. I like it. I like it. Eight of Swords reversed. One card. One card.
page of wands and knight of wands. You could receive some communication. <sighs> Brings you out of a state of anxiety. Could be a fire sign. Okay, I'm not going to beat that dead horse. One on the Seven of Cups. Hermit reversed with a Fortune reversed. Okay. This feels like cruising the date naps to me. <sighs> Exploring options, but not getting back out there just yet. Okay, that's fair. Move slowly. That's fair. I can dig that. No reason to rush into anything. But eventually you actually have to leave the house, just throwing that out there. I see it happening. King of Wands. The King of Wands goes after what he wants and gets it. One in the King of Wands. Six of Cups reversed, seven of Cups reversed. Mm. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't close yourself off to options. Because a love situation left a bad taste in your mouth. Don't do that. feel like that's what some of you might do. It only impedes forward movement when you do that. Knight of Wands reverse Queen of Wands. Really? Don't do that. All right. Talk to me about this Knight of Cups. Don't jade it. Don't get all jaded against love just because something might not work out. What if it does? What if it does? What if it does? That sounds like self-defeating thoughts to me. That's not okay. Page of Swords of First. Oh, gosh. Okay. Watching from afar. Really? This feels like your ability to speak up because of self-defeating thoughts. Don't impede your forward movement. Don't do that to yourself. Seven of Wands to the Eight of Wands. You gotta rise up. You gotta rise up. You gotta defeat your inner demons. You gotta defeat those self-defeating thoughts. You gotta communicate. You gotta put yourself out there. You gotta get to forward movement. When you're ready. Move slowly. Eventually, you have to leave the house, guys. Okay. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Well, I will say, I'm feeling a little bit more refreshed today. To be fair. Okay. To be fair. I like to be fair. Number 38. Life offers experiences that are challenging and experiences that are nurturing. Nourishing. Over time. Yet over time, they strike a balance. You move from being, from stasis, to doing. From discovering, to loving, to letting go, to being again. 
Life is a pendulum swinging between all these states. You will always oscillate back and forth between doing and being. If you are not content with where you are at this moment, remember that all experiences have their place. Accept them without judgment. And you will see how the universe adjusts in perfect balance. You reap what you sow. For every cause, there is an effect. Wondrous things will be revealed now. Do you understand what that means? Do you understand what it's trying to tell you? Your self-defeating thoughts will get you if you allow them. Don't impede your own forward movement. Okay? All right. I'm, I'm going to pause. I'm going to actually hit pause this time. I'm going to clear the decks. Okay. Okay. Aqua Pisces. What do we got for you? Aqua Pisces. Three of Cups reversed at the bottom of the deck. Well, doggone. Return. Problem is, it's already closed out. chariot came to a dead stop. Watching from afar. Something was buried. Huh. Alright, let's look at what's coming in. Why the Hierophant reversed? Tower reversed, star reversed. Something returning to you, you trying to return to something. It's already closed out, the opportunity's been missed. Try to rebuild it because you couldn't heal from it. One more. Five of Swords into the Six of Swords. Whoa, that's a little bit of a confrontation. That's a wake up call. Opportunity already missed. But is that what you're seeing? coins reversed to the nine of coins reversed. Loss on investments, no energy, no effort. Possibly the return. 
You missed the boat, yo. Somebody missed a boat here. Why the Knight of Swords? Talk to me about the Knight of Swords. The sun into judgment. Oh, man. This is going to be a conversation about somebody being happy, a final judgment call being made. One more. King of Wands to the Page of Wands. So the final judgment call. Let somebody going back going after what they want. It's communication what they want. Somebody going after what they want. What makes them happy? This is the this is the conversation. Whoa, that's a boatload of information all of a sudden. Five of coins to the six, six to the seven. Some, somebody wanting it out of the cold. Someone, somebody's put out in the cold. Restoration of balance, patience. Wounded egos, something didn't grow. Ace of Cups to the t Oh, wow. Somebody's going to pour their soul out. Somebody's going to talk about how much it hurt. This, this, is, this, is, this is a conversation, y'all. It's going to be a conversation. I feel like somebody got ghosted here. Like the chariot literally just came to a dead stop. No rhyme, no reason, no explanation, no closure, nothing. I don't know who did what. I'm not pointing fingers. It's not what I do. The conversation will be had sometime within the next month. Between the cusps. Somebody's going to attempt to return. And somebody's going to get told what time it is or what time it was. And that the clock ran out long ago. Hmm. Why the Eight of Wands? <clears throat> Three Wands and the Four of Wands reversed. Oh, yeah. That's a what time it is conversation. No uncertain terms. Somebody has moved on. There will be no rebuilding of this tower. I'm not even going to clarify this. I know. I know what's up with that. I need the, what this four of wands is because that's. Upcoming celebration, but it's not with the person you want to celebrate with. That's upcoming union. Queen of coins. Oh, wow. Queen of coins to the king of coins. Eight of swords, nine of swords. Anxiety of this is going to kick your ass. Don't let it. You are beautiful. You are worthy. You need to find that in and of yourself. One more. Three swords reversed. Four swords reversed. Do not let this break your heart. Do not let this make you restless. Because you are worthy. You are worthy of the union that is coming for you. 
but you need to accept this disconnect. You need to accept that it's over. One on the two of coins, cups reversed. Page of swords reversed to the knight of swords reversed. You Don't try to talk somebody out of it. Put yourself wherever you see fit. If you're the one that moved on and has to tell somebody what time it is, make sure they know what time it is. But be gentle. Don't be a jerk. But stand your ground. If you're the one being told... You need to accept that it's over and not try to talk them out of it. Get what I'm saying? Don't engage with it any further. Let them live their life. Five of Wands. Ten of Swords reversed. Further engagement is only going to cause conflict. And this to just drag on. Two seconds, please. Sorry about that. I had to take a call. Okay. Hmm. Ace of coins reversed to the two of coins reversed at the bottom of the deck. The seed that did not grow. Hmm. Let's get a wisdom on this. This was interesting. All right. That was powerful. Ooh, a twofer. Chaos and conflict and the change in the wind. We're going to take them both. All right, Chaos and Conflict, number 33. Opposing forces come together to create a turbulent atmosphere, but consider the value of chaos that serves you well as you become unmoored by it. Scatter to the winds. You leave behind the parts of yourself you no longer need and disperse seeds to reinvent yourself anew. Although the conflict appears to exist externally, its essence is also internal, projected outward and causing disarray. You may find yourself at cross purposes with someone else, facing a storm you feel you can't control. Yet every storm passes, and chaos leads to a reordering of things. Confl conflict provides a way to see more than one side of a situation. Look upon this as just a moment in time when you need to take shelter and step away from the fray. Don't be too eager to fight. This is a time to understand rather than be understood. Change in the wind. Number 12. It's human nature to yearn for certainty and resist change. To want the world to remain consistent like a zebra stripes. Yet nothing in human existence is black and white nor will anything remain static. The one thing guaranteed is change. Now is a time for transformation as outer conditions are temporarily moving out of sync with your desires and expectations. Stay the course and, remind, and remember that even storms serve to clear the air. Scatter seeds and nourish the soil for better things ahead. 
Life is about to get interesting. Anticipate it with curiosity as you wonder what is coming in on the shifting winds. The unknown is where the magic lies. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. Wow, Aquarius, Pisces, Cusp, Baby. That was awesome. All right, we're going to pause, clear the decks, and move on to Pisces, Aries. All right, Pisces, Aries, Cusp, Babies. Last but certainly not least. My best friend is a Pisces, Aries, Cusp. He's a cool guy. All right. Patiently waiting for the fruits of your labor and investments. The problem is things have gone stagnant and nothing is moving. Possibly a lack of communication. <sighs> All right. Oh gosh, a cup's about to get, get dumped. The lovers, the two of pentacles, and the ace of cups reversed. There is a choice. Which looks like it only inevitably leads to another choice in the dumping of a cup. Why is it happening? Judgment. The knave of cups. And the knave of ones reversed. Okay. Why do I feel like somebody got told where they can shove their stick? Judgment. Page of Cups. That's childish energy. Something tried to... I get clarity on that. I don't know. Something tried to be resurrected. Somebody tried to apologize. Somebody got told where they could shove it. Is this resurrection or ending? Is this judgment call? All right, give me an outcome. Queen of Swords. Oh, clarity. Okay, moon reversed. Well, bottom of the deck, Knave of Swords. Little messenger of truth, even if it's something you don't want to hear. All right. Mm. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right. Whoa, hi. Without intention, the page of wands reversed. Into the knight of wands reversed. Lack of communication, possibly a watching from afar, but not saying anything. Talk to me about the lovers. Talk to me about the lovers. Talk to me about the lovers. Talk to me about the lovers.
Temperance upright and nine of coins reversed. Temperance into the devil. That's a soulmate connection if I have ever seen one. Could be some codependency going on. Could be affecting a family situation. Could be some toxic crap going on. It, that's binding. Oh gosh, that is binding. Six of, six of swords reversed, seven of swords reversed. Oh, wow. Return of a soulmate. Truth coming out? Truth coming out about a soulmate? Having to return? I don't know if this is like physical return or the truth coming out about something that happened. Could be a split story. Way, I'm pretty sure this is going to lead to a cut off in communication and somebody getting told where they can shove their stick. Oh my gosh. Five of cups reversed to the six of cups reversed. Unprocessed emotions, bad blood. This has been sitting for a while. Somebody's going to have to face something that has been sitting there for a while. Unprocessed, unnoticed, untouched, just like boiling. It's like boiling. Why the two of pentacles? Four of wands reversed to the five of wands reversed, king of cups reversed to the page of cups reversed. Oh. Weighing options, weighing options, weighing options. Do I avoid conflict? Somebody's weighing options. Do I repress my emotions and not say anything to avoid conflict? Or do I let the tower fall? Okay. Knight of Coins to the Queen of Coins. Something gone stagnant. One on the Knight of Pentacles reversed. The hair fit and the lovers. Something that went stagnant may not be so stagnant after all. That's why it's creeping back up. Hear me out. Or it may have gone stagnant because someone was already involved. That could be the truth that's coming out for some of you. That might lead to this is where you can shove your stick for sure. One on the Ace of Cups reversed. Mm. Seven of cups reversed to the eight of cups reversed. That's a lot of reversed cups, guys. Confusion. Confusion. Return leading to confusion in a spilt cup. Oh boy. Oh boy. One on judgment. One on judgment. Strength reversed, temperate reversed. Couldn't hold back, had to make a judgment call. 
Exited the situation. Exited the situation. Draining. The situation became too draining. Five of wands reversed to the six of wands reversed. Didn't get what they wanted, but they avoided the conflict. Didn't want to get what they wanted, but they avoided the conflict. Final judgment call. Page of Cups. One on the Knave of Cups. Nine of Cups, Ten of Cups. You make me happy, you are my joy. One more. Whoa. One more. Okay, one reverse to the nine, one reverse the tower. It stopped moving. Someone shows who they were giving their cup to. And something else stopped moving, and a towel was thrown in, a final judgment call was made. Cut off in communication. <clears throat> one of this knave. Seven of wands to the eight of wands. That's not a cut off in communication. Could be for some of you. For some of you, there may the communication may have continued, and it was a cut off of a certain kind of communication. If you're picking up what I'm putting down, sugar and spice and all things nice, sexual energy here. Seven of Wands, Eight of Wands, defeating the demon. The lovers into the chariot. It has shown up again. Wow. The choice was made. Somebody was with someone who was already involved. Okay, Merry Christmas. All right. Um, or happy non-denominational winter holiday, whatever you choose to celebrate. Page of Wands reversed and Nine of Wands reversed. Watching from afar. Not saying anything, not doing anything, just watching from afar. The choice was made. This is going to be revisited. I feel like someone's going to find out truth. And a cup is going to be spilled. Why the Queen of Swords? Why the Queen of Swords? Emperor reversed to the Hierophant reversed. Someone is going to be humbled. Possibly the breakdown of a blessed union. Because of clarity. Someone coming to a state of clarity. Truths being spoken, uh, the Queen of Swords dropping her mighty sword. Oh, man. All right. Chariot reversed into strength reversed. No longer holding back. Chariot's coming to a stop. We're on the moon. To me about clarity. Ace of coins reversed to the two of coins reversed. 
the seed that never grew. Double reverse to the tower reverse. Disconnecting from a powerful connection. Trying to rebuild a tower. The sun and judgment at the bottom of the deck. I don't know who this is for, but bless you. Mm. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Mm. This is going to get heavy. I'm going to have to burn some sage after I get done here. Because this just got very heavy very quickly. It's like shit's gonna go down. I try to make it as non specific as possible. This feels very specific. Between Worlds, number three. Between the worlds is where you must let go of the tendency to make assumptions. This is a time when you are unable to see what is ahead. Cultivate curiosity and just and trust the process of change and growth. You are done learning the lessons of recent experiences in this place between what was and what will be is a state of making and unmaking and making again. What is essential now is to admit not knowing. There's a great freedom and power to be unleashed. A mystery that is yours to understand weaves the web of life within divine matrix of consciousness greater than your own thoughts, feelings, beliefs, desires, and decisions. The seeds that were planted in the past begin to take root. But what surfaces will probably not be what you expect. When you are between the worlds, you are invited to see the curious eyes of a child glimpsing a rainbow for the first time. So do so and you will not be disappointed. Oh, what seeds do you sow and what is going to take root? Okay guys. Sorry about that. Sorry. I mean, the, the universe works in mysterious ways. I've learned to not question it. I apologize for the split read. We're going to try to, I don't know, figure out how to not have that happen next month. But know that you're loved. Be blessed. Have a very safe, wonderful, and happy holiday season. And I will catch you guys next month.